Okay, so now, uh, let me see here. It's on to um, assembling the top of the valves, putting on the valves, uh, the oil seals over the valves, which is diesel things, and then putting the springs on. So there's four valves, two exhaust, two inlets. It's a two cylinder. So you pop the springs on. There we go. And then the spring covers. Okay, and then the fiddly bit is to put these little two halves on to hold the spring down. Usually you can get a, you can buy a, I think, a device to hold these springs down. I don't have that device, so I'm doing this by by holding them down myself. So it's just a matter of pressing it down. Good idea to make sure that these don't fall down. Okay, so that's pretty straightforward enough. I just you can just do one half at a time if you like. That way you minimize the risk of these flying all over the place. So there's the one way they go in. You know, it's pretty obvious when you see them. So when they're in, the two halves just come together. And then they just lock the valve in there. Okay. So they're pretty fiddly bits. Uh, there's a little rim on it to hold it down. So you just one. Press down and get it in. Then the other side, press down. And then, okay. So she's, they're there. So, okay, I'm just going to put a little bit of oil on these as well, on the seats here. And just at the oil flow down there. We'll just keep them. Do you have a problem with number one there? We'll have to have a look at that. That seems good for now. Okay, I'm going to check out number 